Chicken here, bring you another Boom Beach video. In today's video, guys, we're going to be going over some power powder farming with the new Power Stone Chance Tri Boost for hopefully the next Mega Crab, guys. So, uh, before we get into that, I wanted to show you this. So, this is a friendly challenge uh, with Beast Mode using only Sergeant Brick and 40 Medics. So, all eight boats and medics, guys. This is hilarious. This is obviously with. Uh, I'm not sure if he has brick at max. Uh, at, at, at the brick tribes at max level boost or not, but this is brick with the tribes boosted. This is hilarious. Um, she actually does a like a really good amount of damage, but I still stand by what I said yesterday. It's not worth using because how many um, troop combinations are you using where you're gonna have brick? Uh, not just in a smoky situation with Zookas or Warriors. Like, sure, Rifle Crow Zooka Medic is okay um, with using Brick as a standalone, but, like, you're not going to run into many situations where this is, like, super, super helpful. So I think your, your resources are going to be better allocated into uh, the Resource Ward and uh, the Power Stone Chance, guys. But either way, this is still crazy. So I'm going to play this all in, uh, in normal speed, guys, just so you can see all of it here. But it's just nuts. Like, look at this Boom Cannon. It's actually going to shoot her. And look at the look look at the health. It, it, she's almost at half health. And then of course with 40 medics, they're gonna heal her up just instantly. So wanted to start the video off with this, guys. Uh, she's gonna have battle orders there, and that's actually gonna work on his, on herself. So we'll speed it up a little bit here, so it's not too too long. But uh, but yeah, I thought this was pretty hilarious. Maybe later on during the week we can find some bases to pick on uh, using just Sergeant Brick, and uh, and see if she can actually just take anyone down herself. But um, but yeah, I don't know. If you guys have any, like, really good, uh, cool kind of Sergeant Brick strategies where you can really take advantage of using her extra damage and extra health, then let me know that down below in the comments, guys. But you see right here, she'll get up onto the HQ. There's nothing in range that's, uh, that's gonna do a lot of damage to her. But, uh, she gets Battle Orders up, and we'll, we'll put it into 4 speed here, because it does take a very long time. But she does actually get through this, which is what I wanted to show you. So, uh, pretty, pretty interesting for sure. But, like... Again, not not very like uh, realistic to do these kinds of attacks because look at how long that uh, she actually takes to take down this HQ. But she still takes down the HQ herself. So I don't know, guys. Pretty interesting. Do with that what you will. Let's go ahead get into today's. I believe it is a Dr. Terrence, guys. Holy jeez, look at this. One, two, three, four base defense just randomly. Uh, so thank you to to Ku. I'm assuming you did that on purpose, but. Um, either way, should we use Zookas today or should we use Rifle Cryo Zooka Medic with the Ice Shield? I think what we'll do is we'll use Zookas for, um, for, for Dr. Terrence and then we'll, we'll get into maybe a player base if we have, uh, if we have enough time here, guys. So, uh, what we're going to be doing now is taking on Dr. Terrence, of course, like the, the first time anyone's ever seen Dr. Terrence in Bo Boom Beach, guys. Could you imagine a YouTube video being made by the chicken taking on Dr. Terrence? Like, this is just some wild, wild stuff here. So, um... So yeah, I think it's going to be a really good time right now uh, to just not boost as much and just really focus on getting as much uh, power powder as you can because, guys, I, I, the, the chicken can sense the crab. Like, I have a sixth sense for the uh, the mega crab here. I feel like it's just right around the corner. So strap yourselves in this next cycle. Let's just get as much power powder as physically possible. And this is a great kind of, uh, with these with these tribes that we got, I, I kind of touched on this in uh, yesterday's video, but um, yeah, we're going to have to throw the zooks out here. But this is a fantastic tribe cycle to just kind of catch up and farm on everything, which is kind of fun, right? Like, we're going to be able to max out all the tribes. There's going to be no reason that you can't do that. And uh, and, and we're also going to be able to um, to collect a ton of power powder. So we, we do have the, I guess we should show you that. We do have a... Um, we do have the power stone chance at the max boost level, so let's see what kind of extra stones that we can get. Uh, just to show you guys here, we got a 75% and we got the resource reward at 25%. Resource reward 25%, it's not going to be amazing, but it, it definitely helps. So um, definitely upgrade uh, the power stone chance boost first, then um, boost up the resource reward one just to make sure it is working a little bit, and then you go ahead and um, and start all your power powder farming and uh, your resource reward tribe farming and all that kind of fun stuff guys so this is a weird layout i don't think i've seen a layout like this before on dr terrence um the zookas are kind of lagging behind a little bit there we'll toss them on the med kit we did lose a couple in the process but uh, i guess that's okay so you see what i mean about brick's damage here like it, it's it's it literally does nothing in terms of using uh her with smoky style troops because the the damage from the zookas under battle orders like like okay like i guess brick got that sniper tower behind us but i mean that didn't really like change much in the in the in the raid there 
Um, but yeah, like the the damage that she does, sure, it's it's fine, it's good, but it like when you're using Smoky Zoo's battlers, it's not going to, it's not really going to be a large outcome on uh, on what actually happens. So another pretty easy layout here. Uh, this tropical Doctor Terrence is kind of a joke, but uh, I guess we are only on stages one to five. So what I am glad about. And these tribes, there's a lot of people complaining about the tribes. I think I, I think uh, this cycle is fantastic because it gives us a chance to just kind of breathe and catch up. And they don't need to be like miracle, like fireworks going off tribes every single week. Like I think we were just absolutely spoiled with uh, like with, with how good they were the, the first couple the, the first couple cycles. Like I don't think they need to be that crazy. Like it doesn't need to always be Zuka damage and like um, it, it, and, like, an insane amount of, uh, just, like, statue boost in general. I don't think it needs to be that good all the time for them to be an exciting thing. Um, I'm happy with just, um, like, even if we just get one that's decent, like, this week with the, with the Power Stone chance, especially right before Mega Crab. I think that's just perfect, uh, timing on that. Um, so we got some good loot there. We didn't really get, how are we doing for stone so far? Not, to uh, two fragments, uh, two fragments, one flag, two fragments, a shard. One fragment and three fragments. So hopefully we can make that up here and double up on one of these guaranteed crystals, guys. Let's see what we can get done. Uh, we're going to take out these mortars here first on the right side. We're going to flare. We're going to double smoke the Zooka landing just like that. We're going to be able to get brick in there. And I think they're going to be able to bunch up nicely by that flag. Um, I'm actually going to go ahead and throw a barrage there because I know I'm going to have the GB for it. And we might as well not walk over any of those mines if we don't have to. But... Um, Oh, a cool thing about Brick, with her health boost now, I think when you have it at max level, she can walk over 50 regular mines and 2 boom mines, which is pretty crazy. Like, Brick was always uh, fantastic for mine clearing, but now it's just, like, kind of ridiculous. But, like, yes, it is going to be difficult to to uh, to keep her in line, especially because she doesn't always listen to flares. But, I don't know, like, if, if you want to use Brick as a minesweeper and then get the battlers off, like, if there's specific situations you can do that in, that's going to be huge. Uh, so let's give a big shout out to the commenter of the day. That's going to be Blitzkrieg, a.k.a. GM, a.k.a. all of his other aliases, guys. Uh, big shout out to GM down below in the comments. So stage 7, guys. Stage 7. Let's see what we have in store for the chicken today. Um, okay, so lots of mortars. But they're all kind of bunched together, so that's fine. Um, we can go like this and like this next. And let's go ahead. Did I seriously miss those two mines somehow? Golly, chicken, that's not good. Um, I, I was going to say, if we miss those again, it's just time to uh, to wrap it up here. But I that was such a waste of GB. Such a waste of GB, you guys. Now it's actually going to be tricky to uh, to make sure that we get there. But um, since we took out every mine within like a 10-mile radius, we can just do kind of a sloppy walk right up about here is where the chicken is thinking. We'll let that machine gun shave us down just a little bit. And then we're going to kind of make this nice, long, wide, uh, nice, just casual walk with the Zookas on the beach, guys. And then we're going to one-smoke them. Okay, it wasn't even a max mine, so that's good. Um, yeah, so then we'll get them all right about here, and then it's it's going to be kind of sloppy. We're just going to, like, shock, battle orders, med kit for the win. Uh, I'm actually going to let the flamethrower hit them, and I think... Um, I think we'll actually be able to uh, just med kit right through it. So it's going to be gross, guys. It's going to be ugly, but we're going to end up taking down stage seven. Stage seven goes down. So uh, let's go ahead. Let's try to take on one player base here before we wrap things up, guys. Can we get an extra crystal, please, with this power storm chance boost? Does not look like it, guys. Does not look like it. So not very good on the Dr. Terrence uh, power powder farming. But let's um, let's see what we can get done with a uh, with a quick player base here, guys. So what do we got loaded up? Do we, do we have them all taken down already? Um, hmm. I guess we don't have any player bases, guys. So that's going to wrap it up for the video today. So make sure to let me know down below in the comments, guys, if you were able to uh, take away any extra crystals from Dr. Terror today or just in general how your uh, power power fire has been going. Are you excited for the Mega Crab? Let me know all that down below in the comments, guys. That's going to wrap it up for the video today. Make sure to leave a like if you found it interesting, entertaining, or informative. And we'll see you in the next one, guys. Chicken out. Bye -bye.